365 meters down. 460 meters inside the Earth's crust. Layer upon layer of rock, each with a story to tell. Marble made of ancient sea creatures, heated, compressed, and heated again. These layers are the pages in our planet's story, made up of dust, mud, vegetation, even animal life, that was laid down over millions of years. Sandstone, the compressed remains of a long forgotten desert. As wind and water move material around the planet, new layers built up above. One layer buried another and another, squeezing the material beneath until they turned to rock. Basalt, once a mighty volcano ground down by wind and rain. This layer isn't like the others. It's thinner and seems to go on forever. It contains an element called iridium. Iridium is rare on Earth, but abundant in space. Nearly 600 meters inside the Earth's crust, a layer of space rock. 550 meters beneath Denver, Colorado, we've discovered a layer of extraterrestrial rock. Once this rock sat on the surface, which means Denver was covered in space dust. It sounds like science fiction, but the reality is even stranger. An asteroid bigger than an entire city. Sixty-five million years ago, it plunged straight towards Earth, to a planet ruled by dinosaurs, where T-Rex reigned unchallenged. He was as heavy as an elephant. His meter-long jaw was engineered for maximum bone-crushing action. And he had no predators. Nothing could unseat this Lizard King. But 2,400 kilometers to the south, a storm was brewing. The asteroid struck off Mexico's Yucatan coast. And released the energy of 100 million atomic bombs. At the point of impact, temperatures reached 20,000 degrees Celsius. Hot enough to vaporize the Earth's crust. Every living thing within a 500 kilometer radius. And the asteroid itself. The impact smashed them all into a towering dust cloud. 